Blue Protocol Network Test, also known as the final closed beta test in Japan, is almost here. There have been so many memories leading up to this point that I cannot just fathom to uh, leave out, guys. Like, there's, there's so many things, and I absolutely love all the memories that I've made up to this point with Blue Protocol. I originally started investing my time into the game back in 2019, back when I was looking for a brand new MMO to try out. Then I came across Blue Protocol's official website. I was surprised to know it was under Bandai Namco. As soon as I started to look at the very first trailer, I was sold from the moment it started. The music, the story of the trailer, the gameplay, and don't forget the amazing visual aesthetic appeal to the game that just swept me off of my feet. From that moment on, I was heavily invested in making videos geared towards Blue Protocol. From joining the first closed beta test, diving deep into the prologue, story elements, classes, and more, it further invested me into the game. The alpha testing alone looked visually appealing to me, and while I didn't participate, that I just could not get away from the game. It was just that good. A few moments later, a few months later I should say, I was able to participate in a small network test after the first CBT, also known as the second closed beta test at the end of 2020. While it was more or less the same as the first test, it was also heavily cut down from the first. Gameplay was improved, but everyone was locked into the main city and only able to play the dungeons alongside other Blue Protocol fans. It was a very short test, but regardless, another exciting experience being able to play the game once again. While 2021 and 2022 was a very dark period for the Project Sky Blue team, Blue Protocol's community continued to thrive and talk about the game. For the North American and other country regions, we had to sit back and wait for the global version to be officially announced. It wasn't until recently, back on December 8th, 2022, we finally had our first look at the game being updated and the announcement of Blue Protocol coming later this year. Now, while some fans are skeptical about Amazon publishing the game in the West, hopefully the game will stay true to the way the developers at Bandai intended the game to become. I, for one, will regardless be looking forward to the global version of the game and look forward to playing the game alongside everyone in the community. While I would easily be playing the Japanese version of the game when it launches, I feel like a lot of my time will be spent in the global version of the game when it officially launches in the West. Now we are just less than a week away from the final network test, also known as the final closed beta test for Japan's version of Blue Protocol. I have been fortunate enough to be able to accept to be accepted into the closed beta test for Blue Protocol in Japan. This will be our last glimpse at the game before it launches or before a global closed beta test will begin. So with that being said, we have seen some pretty epic gameplay from Gamatsu. Game uh, landscapes, updated class gameplay, updated raid boss mechanics, and more. With that being said, I am happy to announce I will be playing the upcoming closed beta test, and I cannot wait to share not only videos for Blue Protocol fans from my perspective, but also a full live stream from start to finish of the test period. I cannot wait to explore the world and have fans join alongside me live. I plan to live stream on Twitch on Saturday at midnight. These times will be a little weird for some because for me in Eastern time, it is midnight, but others, it is in different time zones. I plan to stream Blue Protocol on Friday officially at 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time Zone. That is translated to 7 p.m. Central and 6 p.m. Pacific. Now keep in mind, that's when I plan to start streaming. I will be starting off with Final Fantasy XIV because I will be raiding that, night, that, same ra that same night, of course, with my team. But as soon as it is finished, I plan to switch over for an hour before Blue Protocol begins to chill and chat with fans and log in to Blue Protocol. I'm extremely excited to play all of the classes with their updated skills and actions. It will be so much fun being able to experience all of the updated features in the game and possibly new zones as well. 
I can't wait to explore and experience the game once again. However, one last thing to note is on January 10th, there will be maintenance. This will most likely be a bandwave and a website upload of the game client. Players will be able to download the game for those participating in the test. However, as I just mentioned, it is also possible many people from North America and throughout other places outside of Japan could be banned from the test. This will also be the final determination of who will be in or out of the test. If I do not happen to get banned, then I will let everyone know. But if I'm not, then we will continue as planned. I just wanted to let everyone know about that as some didn't know about the ban waves in the past two closed beta tests. It definitely threw me for a loop when I first knew about that. When, with that being said, I may or may not have also have a giveaway account for Blue Protocol's upcoming test. I don't want to promise anything as I don't know if the account will get banned or not. So if that does happen, then I'll let you know. But if not, then I would be happy to do a one account giveaway that I have uh, for fans. And I hope that I can and it doesn't get banned, <laughs> but we'll see how that goes. Either way, I'm looking forward to keeping everyone updated with guides, gameplays, and more for Blue Protocol going forward. I, it's going to be a heavy niche and a heavy thing for me and a heavy piece of content that I plan to dive head forward and straight forward with all of my fans and of course the Blue Protocol community. I hope that you guys enjoy my content and of course please don't forget to give me feedback. I love and enjoy everyone's feedback that you, you, you guys have been giving me from kind comments. Uh, liking my videos and helping me out and of course supporting me by subscribing to my YouTube channel. So if you guys are continuing to do that, that would be absolutely great for me to know what you guys want to see from my channel. Either way, I'm looking forward to keeping everyone updated with guides, gameplays, and more from Blue Protocol going forward. Please join me on Twitch as we go live for Blue Protocol. I will then restream it on YouTube after the test is officially ended. Then everyone on my YouTube channel can also see if they did not see me on Twitch. Thank you all, and I look forward to seeing every single one of you in the world of Regnus. As always, stay frosty, everyone.